Citavi's new Grouped Bibliography feature lets you create sections in your bibliography along with subheadings. You can use the Group Bibliography feature to create sections for primary and secondary sources, or you can sort out the internet sources from the print sources in your paper, or you can group sources by year. How can you set this up? Well, we'll go to Citavi and then click Citation, Group Bibliography, Create or Edit Grouping. If we want to create a grouping that puts internet sources at the end of our bibliography, we can click the plus sign for a new grouping and then enter a name for the grouping. And after that, we'll click Add Section. I'll select Reference Types and then I'll choose references with this reference type, Internet Document, and I can choose a manual heading if I would like. So we'll say Online Sources, and then I can click OK. Here you'll see that the rest of the sources will appear first without a heading or with the normal bibliography heading and then the online sources will appear later on. What does this look like? Well, let me switch to my document. And here you can see I have my bibliography, and to apply the grouping I would just go up to the grouping menu and choose online sources. And then when we scroll down we'll see our online sources. You can also create a grouping for primary and secondary sources. To do this, you have to let Citavi know which sources are primary sources and which are secondary sources. So, I'll create two groups and click OK. And now I'll click another group. And then you would go ahead and drag the references to the appropriate category. This is just for the purposes of examples, so you'll see that a lot of these uh, references probably aren't actually primary or secondary sources, but just so we have a few things uh, as an example. And we'll get some from the bottom of our list as well. Okay. Now we'll want to create another grouping. We'll go to the citation menu, click Group Bibliography, and then Create or Edit Grouping and I'll click the plus sign that looks good and then we'll add a section and now we can use this first one groups and say that we want to sort first by the primary sources group here I'll leave the heading as automatic and then this name will appear in the bibliography then we'll click OK. And then I'll add another section. And now I'll add my second group, secondary sources. And you'll notice here that some remain. These are the references that don't have a group. And maybe I'll want these to appear down at the bottom below these two groups. And then if I have my sources that aren't in a group, I can check them later on and add them to the appropriate group. And then that's what you get when Citavi has applied the formatting. One other thing you could do is to group by publication year. And to do that, uh, you would also go up to the Group Bibliography feature, uh, so Citation Group Bibliography, Create or Edit Grouping. And then we might say by year. We'll add our section, and we can then look at additional criteria and by year derived. 
we will click OK. And then we'll go to our document and apply this new grouping. Great, so that's how it looks. You could also have this sorted from most recent publications to least recent publications. You can find additional information in our online manual. And one thing you can also find is some example groupings. And here you can import a grouping definition into your project. You can find this option again here in the citation menu, Group Bibliography, Create or Edit Grouping. And here you have an import option and an export option. The export option is really handy if you want to use the same grouping definition for another Citavi project because these settings are always going to be project specific. So by using the export definition feature, you can export your grouping that you define for one project and use it in another. Thanks for watching, and we hope you enjoy the new grouped bibliography feature.